Hello everyone and welcome to this video. I'm going to be doing something that I think people will find very interesting today, which is a live test of Claude Sonnet 3.7 thinking. Now when this first came out, I made some remarks about not being a fan of reasoning models. However, after using it a little bit more and giving it a bit of a chance, I've discovered that I think it might have, it might be a lot better than I actually thought it was. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be comparing the thinking model to the non-thinking model. Now, if you don't know, I made this website very recently. I've been testing DeepSeek, etc., using this model, right? What I'm going to, sorry, using this prompt. What I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to use the same prompt, but with Claude thinking. So let's make a service-based website and let's see how good this model actually is. Okay, so let's do the same setup that we always do, keep the test fair. So basically what I always do is, first of all, I create the project. I'm just going to use my own school uh, because this is pissing me off. I'm trying to do everything on ChatGPT and stuff, but uh, it's just a lot easier just to use this. So I have the these uh, modules right now, and one of them is uh, all of my prompts in one place. And then I have this SOP here. So this is basically the SOP that I'm going to be using in this video. So first thing is to create a Next.js project uh, with this specific uh, number here. And then this should create the app. I've just realized this is called my app, which is probably already, it probably already exists. If you want to sign up to school, by the way, guys, I'm going to try and make this the best that I possibly can. Right now it's already looking really, really good. Um, I do recommend that people join it. So this is done. This is my app, my app. So let's see the my app. So we've now created that. And then we need to open the folder. So we'll go to my app here and then inside here, we'll go to my app and then select folder. And then inside here, let's do plus and say public and then plus folder and say images. And then we'll just drag and drop from a previous version of this, let's say the deep seek one. Um, so all you need to do here is just put any images that you want the AI to use. So public images, let's just drag and drop these actually we'll copy so that they're still there if I need them to be. There we go. Now we're ready to use Klein. We'll go grab the prompt from Google Docs just because it's already got all of the data that I needed to have in there. The empty one can be found on school where you can fill in and put your own uh, data basically. So we'll paste this. You can also find it for free on pre previous videos, guys. It's not paywalled. It's a free prompt. I'm not deleting it from previous videos. I'm just not going to be putting it in uh, the description of every video. You'll just have to go find it, but it should be easy to find. Like I've put it on a million videos before. So let's try this out. This is the thinking version of this. I'm really curious to see if this produces something that's significantly better or the same as the non-thinking model and also the cost, right? Because they're both really, really important. So at the moment it's just thinking. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll see how this goes. At this point, by the way, you can basically go do whatever you want. So I can, I have all this all approve, approve on, it's on 1000. I can literally just go and chill and come back. So we'll just follow this plan, this planning stage just because I'm, I'm curious to see how it goes. Let's see. Good. Good, good, good. Yeah, this all looks good. Um, I'm just going to say make sure to fully plan the branding and colors, etc. too. I leave all of this to your discretion. I don't know if that's how you spell discretion. So let's see what it comes up with. Okay, it's coming up with pretty much the same colors. Pearl white, though, that's nice. I like that. It always uses Playfair, which is interesting. Gold background, it's pretty much the same. Oh, here we go. Animation, parallax, damn. Imagine this, like if it does all that, that would be super nice. If it manages to nail all of that, that's going to be super, super cool. Let's just press act here, and then I'm going to go uh, do whatever with my time. Okay, so one thing to note is that if the output of a file is too big, there's some kind of mistake here where you can't actually use the 
the thinking model, right? So I've had to just change it over to the normal model quickly. The reason being is that it, the output is too long and it's trying to just one shot uh, the entire changes and it's just not working. Okay, so this is what it has come up with. Now this has some nice animations to it for sure. Very similar to Claude uh, Sonic 3.7. I would say this looks better. It has better animation and um, I would I'd say it's slightly better, but I, I wouldn't say that it was enough better um, for it to be like, oh my god, we need to use this, right? Uh, and it definitely looks nice. The animations are definitely better. It's added pricing. It's got really... Actually, this is definitely better. This is definitely better looking. Um, obviously, none of, none of this stuff will work, but that's fine. Um, it's better one shot as well. Like, it just gave me this pretty much instantly. Some things aren't working like the Italian, but that's fine. Um, I'd say this is marginally better than Sonic 3.7 without thinking, um, but the cost is definitely getting up there, right? So in terms of whether this is game changing, etc., I wouldn't say so. I would say it's slightly more expensive for a slightly better result. Um, and it seems to be more reliable. Uh, like the I haven't really, I haven't really had to prompt it or anything like that. It's, it's been very good. Everything is working. Uh, there's just a few things. So now this does work, for example. Uh, but yeah, overall, I would say probably slightly worth it. Um, it's slightly slower, slightly more expensive, but slightly better. That's going to be the end of this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you're watching all the way to the end of this video, you're an absolute legend. And I'll see you very, very soon with some more content. Peace out.